Hi, I'm Sebastian. And I'm Chris. In this video, we explain how we reconstruct HDI images from a single photograph with the help of intrinsics. Photos captured with everyday cameras typically contain clipped highlights and desaturated colors. This makes the bright areas look dull, and the captured photographs fail to match our experience of the real world. In our work, we reconstruct the highlights in the desaturated colors separately in the reflectance and shading domains. This separation simplifies the training of neural networks, allowing us to generate accurate details and reconstruct the vivid colors in the scene without introducing artifacts. Let's take a closer look into single image HDR reconstruction. Real world scenes have high contrast with many different brightness values, called HDR or high dynamic range. Our eyes are evolved to perceive the common dynamic range in our surroundings. Most displays are far more limited and can only handle a small range of luminance values. When taking photos, the internal processing of the camera reduces the contrast of the scene to fit into this narrow range. As a result, the highlights are clipped and a lot of information is lost. HDR reconstruction aims to recover the full contrast of the original scene. When the original information is restored, we can more realistically display the image and we can achieve applications such as relighting and illumination where editing. But this task is very complex. A single network would have to invert the entire camera pipeline. In addition to clipping, this also involves dequantization and linearization of the input image. Therefore, it's much easier to use dedicated networks for each of these tasks. This strategy was introduced by Lou and colleagues, and it's the basis of our proposed pipeline. Our work focuses on inverting the clipping step. Here, you make an important observation. The type of artifacts differs between the brightness and the color information. In the brightness domain, the clipping causes all pixels to maximize. Details and small differences between pixels are lost. In the color domain, the effect is different. Because bright areas are now interpreted as white, the original color information is lost, and the area appears desaturated. In our proposed system, we address these two effects separately. In order to separate these two domains, we use intrinsic image decomposition. Using a recent method, we decompose the image into a monochromatic shading layer and an albedo layer. The shading represents the illumination in the scene, while the albedo represents the surface colors and texture. Similar to the LDR image, the LDR shading is clipped and the LDR albedo is desaturated. Our pipeline consists of two convolutional networks that recover this information, one for shading and a separate one for albedo. With the decomposition, the shading network can focus on recovering the highlights and doesn't need to reason about the colors in the scene. The correlation between the shading and the geometry allows it to use geometric cues for this task. This is an advantage of the shading over RGB-based brightness, and it simplifies the reconstruction task greatly. It enables the network to generate detailed highlights without introducing color artifacts. In parallel, our albedo network has a far more constrained setting. Since the scale of the albedo remains between 0 and 1, the task is similar to in-paint the missing colors from the surrounding. As a result, it generates consistent surfaces and lively faces. The two generated outputs are combined with our final refinement network. This step turns the disconnected components into a consistent RGB image and it removes artifacts from previous stages. To reiterate, our pipeline starts with the decomposition of an input LDR photograph. We first recover the lost color information in the albedo and then reconstruct the lighting information in the shading domain. After refining the product of these two components, we end up with our final HDR result. When compared to prior works, our method can recover accurate details in overexposed regions. Thanks to our formulation, our method estimates artifact-free color information for saturated pixels. I think that's good.